All right, awesome. I've been waiting for this one for a little while now. I'm getting pretty excited. I've got uh, a whole bunch of filament that needs drying out before I can get back into my 3D printing because it's a bit too brittle to use at the moment. So I ordered the Comgro filament dryer. So I did um, do a bit of research and this was the one that seemed to pass all of the tests and it fits two reels at once. So really looking forward to seeing how it performs. Nice instruction manual. So we'll just go through the unboxing today and see what is in the box. Cool, so this is looking pretty nice. It, uh, it presents well. So we've got a plug on the back, a um, receiver for our DC power supply, I'm assuming, and then couple of locks on the front, so we'll flick those up. I think that's all the foam. Okay, so this is what we've got. The Comgro box, nicely made. I uh, particularly like these ports on the top. They have little rubber stoppers. Ooh. And that's where the filament is going to come out. Oh yeah, they plug up nicely. And then in the little box, I assume this will be our power supply. Yep. So what's this? 100 to 240 volt input. Now, this is going to be different depending on which country you ordered it in. Um, they ship these all over the world. So I'm in Australia. I've got the Australian plug. Just make sure that you're ordering the correct one. But they should all come with the standard 5.5 millimeter DC barrel on the other end. And outputs 12 volts and 4 amps. Excellent. And then inside we have some rollers. And there is a little fan at the back that moves the air around. And then underneath these rollers, I don't know if I can get in there easily. Nope, I think it requires screws to remove that, so I won't. But that gold section you can see underneath is the heating element. So it's a nice tidy little unit. I'll do some experiments with this one and run a few tests and I'll record another video showing how it operates and giving my thoughts. But that is the unboxing of the Comgro filament dryer. Mm -hmm.